Hello folks and welcome to the latest episode and this is going to be a look at the Estes Power Patrol it's my latest rocket to add to my collection as you can see we're expecting around about 1100 feet that is without an altimeter in it which we're going to have so we'll probably be a little under that and it's looking pretty damn cool it always reminds me of the in-betweeners actually Pussy Patrol let's have a look at it put it together I've taken everything out of the box and this is what you're presented with it doesn't look like it should be a too hard a job so let's put it together and I'll show you the final result there we go folks Power Patrol all put together I've put some static ports in the side which you can probably just about make out there uh, it's quite tightly packed in there so hopefully we'll still get an accurate altitude reading there's only one way to find out and that's by flying her yes so folks here we are outside for Power Patrol's maiden flight you can see she's on the pad here and to give you an idea of the sort of conditions that you'll want to fly this rocket well if you look we've got absolutely beautiful clear sky so we can see the smoke trail locate it and barely a breath of wind that's exactly what you want and you can see we're going for a different camera angle here so uh, that'll be interesting to see how that works out that's by request so uh, yeah let's see how she flies and I also just wanted to mention, of course, the motor I'm using is a C65, so we're expecting some pretty high performance here. Oh yeah! Righty ho, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Where'd she go? Ah, there she is. So folks, she went up pretty high and even uh, even then, in these conditions, she's still gone quite a long way. But uh, yep, a successful recovery and that's how she landed. Excellent. Right, well let's take her back to base and uh, I'll give you my final thoughts. So I hope you enjoyed that launch footage of the Estes Power Patrol. As I say, that top down view was by request. I also was quite keen to see how it would turn out myself. So how about the rocket then? Well, if we start from the bottom with the fins here, uh, really easy to install, nice and straight, rounded edges. You can see they just uh, slip in here, took all of about a minute to install those. Moving up, there was some slight damage out of the box. You can uh, just see it there, a very slight crease. Um, but it's still strong. It hasn't affected the flight characteristics whatsoever. So no real biggie. And moving down, the only other slight problem there's this little bit of uh, card you can see that's come away from the top there, just beneath the nose cone. But that's nothing a quick bit of time with the wood glue won't fix. Uh, as I say, parachute deployed perfectly. 12-inch uh, parachute's always going to carry something uh, this size miles away. There was no perceptible wind, and I'd say it still went about 350 yards downwind. So a fair old walk. Would I recommend it? Yeah, it flies straight, it flies true. It takes about five minutes to put together and it's lots and lots of fun. Certainly a great rocket for getting into the hobby with anyway. Well, that's it for my review of the Estes Power Patrol. If you enjoyed it, please do rate, comment and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time.